Welcome back everybody, today I'm with UNSC Hackett and we're checking out his latest ship that he's brought to the lineup review. What is the name of the ship? Well, right now it's the USS Frontier, Frontier class, which kind of made up. I don't think it's an actual ship in Star Trek. So oh, sorry mate, speak up a bit. Oh, sorry. <clears throat> uh, it's the USS Frontier. Uh, yep. I made up the ship. And, uh, USS Frontier. Unique. Yep, Frontier class is what I'm calling it. It's meant to be a uh, not combat -y oriented vessel. Not combat, yep. Is there anything particular you want me to, sh you know, want to show? Because it looks like an original design. Um, you know, there's not much to the interior, uh, but um, I, I am, uh, I do like what I do with the turrets. I don't know if you noticed them. They're uh, actually recessed almost all the way down into the ship. Yeah, I see that. And they work they work pretty well actually. Let's take a look at how far down he's gone in there. Oh, all the way. Yeah, very nice. So you can see these turrets are actually quite deep in uh, recessed into the dish. That's really nice. They actually work in fire and everything still too. I see some logic on your bridge as well. What's that for? Oh, that's just for Ooh, night vision mode. Yeah, things go red, but not. Nice chairs. Oh, thank you. Simple chairs, but nice. Really nice. Different stations. Awesome. And not a wedge gone to waste. Although I'm out of power, it seems. Yeah, that bug's happening a lot. That's funny, because I've got, like, if I haven't got any power, I can't move. So anyway, let's do it in build mode. So let's just aim up a bit to like there. There we go. So there it is. What was the name of it again? The USS Frontier. Frontier by yep. UNSC Hackett. I like the wedging on it. It's very smooth, you know. And yeah, you can see it's not an OBJ or anything. You've clearly done this in game, yeah? Yeah, I built it on the server actually. Oh, what? Wait, survival? Huh? Yeah. <laughs> so this is built survival. How long did it take? Oh, it's been. This is, I started this when the reset happened, so it's been like a month ish. A month. About a month to do this. But it's legit though. You crafted every block. Oh, yeah. Yeah. Badass. So that just makes it that much more elevated, in my opinion, now you said that. Oh. <laughs> well. I know it might have taken a month, but, you know, it's a nice ship, it's complete, you know. Is that advanced hull? Yes, that is, actually. Ah, and it is a advanced hull. time to make. That took <laughs> wow. a really long time to make. Yeah, yeah, I can imagine. That's why, uh, I ran, if you see, I ran out of it uh, halfway through the, uh, the interior, so the other half is just standard. Oh well, yeah, that's what it's for <laughs> but, though, isn't it? Yeah, yeah. Oh yeah, yeah. Nice, got a little warp core. Yep, little There's green the core. warp core down there. Go up here. There are some personnel rooms. Oh, shuttle, shuttle bay. Yep, nice shuttle. shuttle bay. On, uh, as I say, each side of the saucer, there's a, a little decontamination room. We're at the entrance, actually. On each side and it's used with logic so that way uh, you just walk in and you get put gravity and the doors open and all that jazz oh yeah I see it excellent so it does all that for you got a little table and chairs yep you can wait for your friends to go through decon got a med bay I guess or a crew members room whichever Yep, that's a yeah, crew quarters on each side. And then the bridge. Yep. Beautiful, man. Right, well, thanks so much for bringing this in for review. I uh, hope to see more from you in the coming weeks. And, um, yeah, go ahead and... Uh, hup, I'll just get out of the way. Oh, I still can't move, can I? Yeah, I can't either. I'm a... No one can move. Yeah, so thanks Wait. for coming by. <laughs> and, uh, yeah, can't wait to see you again soon. And yep. thanks everyone to watch, so see you next time. <laughs>